Hi, welcome back to another Clip Studio art tutorial where we're going to learn about anthropomorphism. Before I actually begin to show you guys the speed paint, I wanted to show what I did behind the scenes. For example, I developed first the palette. Well, very first, <laughs> I decided what I wanted to turn into a person, and that was a frap, a very aesthetic looking one, so I thought it would be very nice to turn into a person, and from that point on I developed my palette from these colors. I thought it would be better to stick to a lot of browns because in coffee you see a lot of brown, especially with this one where you see that it's a fading gradient from like a milky brown to a darker brown, especially with the chocolates. In terms of her design, I wanted to make a few notes, especially because some of the ideas that I had for her outfit weren't necessarily corresponding to <laughs> the coffee over here. The cookies I kept with that scene later on outside of the draft because I added them later on because I wanted it to be authentic to what's actually in the picture. However, um, this part of the skirt here that looks kind of like a bowl, that is more to match up with the stereotypical frappe where you see that they have a plastic dome covering the foam and the, and the chocolate lining that they put over the whipped cream. I thought it would be kind of fun to add it to her design because we just know a lot of cold coffees with that type of top. As for her skirt, I wanted to mess around more with the hot coffee design because at least here, they give you hot coffees with a brown paper cup and that is usually what's associated with coffee so I thought I'd give it to her because <laughs> she is a coffee basically but turned into a person. As for her straw, I decided to keep it just because it would be fun. It adds more of a whimsical feel to it and I thought it'd be silly to keep it. But anyways, I hope you enjoy the speed beat. And that has been all. I hope you guys enjoyed and it has given you a bit of insight <laughs> as to how I designed her. Um, also, I want to apologize for my voice to sound a little grave. <laughs> um, I'm currently sick, but I will really wanted to post this because I had fun designing her character. I haven't really done something like this before and I thought it was an interesting concept because I see it a lot on social media and I thought it would be kind of fun to make a coffee, something that I really liked into a person <laughs> but anyway i hope this has helped if you have any questions feel free to ask and before i sign off i would like to say that this is for clip studios april tips month and thank you for watching <laughs>